Hello everyone, how to solve this problem for the values of x if we have x square square root divided by x is equal to 2 and we solve this problem for the values of x. So here first we find all the roots of this equation and at the last we will be verify that which of the roots are solution and which of the roots are extraneous root. Further we solve this problem for two methods. I hope so you like both of these methods. But if you have any other method in your mind, so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section. And uh, here uh, in the first method, uh, you see into the left hand side of question statement is that uh, here our x is divided by left hand side. When we move it into the right hand side, it is multiplied by 2. So here we do the first step is that we move this x to the right hand side. So when this x is multiplied by this 2, it will be written as square root of x square is equals to this is uh, 2 times of x. And further in the next step, this 2 and this square root are gone and we will get here our x is equals to uh, this will becomes 2 times of x. So here uh, for in order to find the values of x, we need to move this x to the right hand side. And when we move this x to the right hand side, it will be written as uh, 2x and minus this, uh, this is the positive x. When we move it into the right hand side, it will become the negative x. And this whole equation is equals to 0. And now we need to subtract uh, these two values and you see here both of these terms involve x which means that both of these terms have same variable terms. So when you subtract this value with this we will get here our x is equals to 0. Okay. So uh, it means that from first method we will get here the value of x is equals to 0. And now here in the next steps we need to verify that is this value of x is satisfied our given question statement or not. Okay. So for verification of solution of this problem, uh, we need to copy down given question statement here. The given question statement is square root of x divided by x is equals to 2. This is the our given question statement. And here we check that is x be the solution or is x be the extraneous root. Okay. Uh, so for this we substitute x is equals to 0 into the left hand side. So when we put this into the left hand side, it will be written as 0 square and its square root divided by 0 is equals to 2 and here you know about that 0 square becomes 0 square root divided by 0 is equals to 2 or not this is the our claim okay uh, so 0 square root uh, is equals to 0 divided by 0 is equals to 2 so you see here this will become 0 over 0 form in or usually we will just call that it is the indeterminate form. So if this is the indeterminate form or in other words we say that it is undefined. So if our left hand side is indeterminate or undefined uh, this means that both of the sides are not equal. So if both of the sides are not equal, this means that the value of x is equal to 0 is not satisfied our given question statement. So if x is equal to 0 is not satisfied the given question statement, this means that x is equal to 0 be the extraneous root of the given equation. So if uh, 0 be the extraneous root, but here you see that we cannot get any other value of x. So we have just only one value of x and it is not satisfied our given question statement. So we finally conclude about the solution set of this question is that this question has no solution. So here I can just uh, explain the difference between extraneous root and solution. Uh, so the roots which is satisfied our given question statements is called the solution. Unfortunately, this question has no solution, but the roots which does not satisfy our given question statement is called the extraneous root. Likewise, you see here x is equals to 0 be the extraneous root because it does not satisfy our given question statement. So this is the final conclusion about the solution of this problem. And now here <clears throat> we move towards the second method. And in the second method, uh, we first we need to copy down given question statement here. 
So the given question statement is square root of x square divided by x is equals to 2. So here we need to <coughs> simplify the terms and here we get the values of x. So here we, uh, we just use the uh, direct techniques to uh, get the values of x from here. Okay. So uh, here first we focus into the left hand side and you see here this 2 and this square root are gone and we will get here x divided by x is equals to 2. And you see here this x is also cancelled out by this x and we will get here 1 is equals to 2. And we know, uh, yeah, we know that uh, 1 is not equals to 2 in general. Okay, These two values are not equal. Uh, so uh, if both of these two values are not equal, this means that we cannot get any value of x. So if we cannot get any value of x, so this concludes that uh, this question has no solution. Okay, because if we cannot get any value of x, so this means that it has no solution because uh, the value of x is not exist. Okay, so uh, this is the, our final answer and thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.